Hello all and welcome to another Kevin Entertainment video. It's Art here with the review for New York Dead by Stuart Woods. It's the first Stone Barrington novel. How did I like it? First of all, I liked the character Stone Barrington himself. I felt it had a, a little bit of Harry Bosch, a little bit of Lucas Davenport, a little bit of Jack Reacher, and a little bit of Walt Longmire rolled into one, plus a dash of his own thing. However, I feel like Stuart Woods didn't know where he wanted to take the first book because halfway through the first book, it switches from being a detective novel to a legal novel and it's just completely discombobulating and, and jarring as a fact of just reading the book. It becomes very muddled and confused in the middle part of the book. Now, the end part of the book actually ends up pretty succinct and decent I'm not gonna say great but the middle part muddling it and a whole bunch of confusion and a whole bunch of things that weren't central to the plot and didn't need to be in there is what for me drew this book down quite a ways it's what for me made this book not as good as it could or should have been doesn't mean it was bad but it could have been way 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 better because the action sequences and the detective sequences in the book were actually quite tight the legal sequences were actually quite good a little bit of law and order esque in that sense and in that nature so those were on point it was the filler in between that I didn't need to know. Uh, Stone Barrington does certain things that men of his caliber and of his ilk would not do. Especially after things that happened to him in the book happened to him. And if Stone Barrington was as good as a detective as he's portrayed to be in the beginning to the middle of the book then they would have found a way for him to say for him to stay a detective or in the police force going forward now does this mean I didn't like the book no I liked the book well enough but this does mean that there were serious first novel problems that I hope get better. Will I continue on with the series? Of course I'll continue on with the series. It's too good of a series not to continue on and like I said I did rather enjoy the character of Stone Barrington and as many of you know I'm already reading book two which is Dirt. Uh, so that's good. I just hope the series gets better or becomes better. I hope it finds its, its way is the best way to put that. I really, really hope that it finds its way because it needs to find its way. It's not that it's bad, but get ready for New York Dead not to blow your socks off. Get ready to be confused get ready to be bum bungled and blindsided by the book because there's many different revelations that you don't see coming and make no sense whatsoever and really have no bearing or effect on the plot um it's for me it's a read it like it own it if you choose because it's part of a series on my scale. It is a 3.5 to 4 star read, but in the case of Goodreads, I'm gonna give it three stars because it's it's just too problematic. And it's not that it's not that it's old because the Stone Barrington novels are I believe 28 novels now. It's not that it's aged, it's just that it it could have done with a, a better 
sense of editing. It could have done with a better sense of making things succinct and tight and making things make sense. I think that he should have read through it at least one more time to make it a much tighter, more concise book. I understand that he was trying to make Stone Barrington stand out, but I think New York Dead made Stone Barrington stand out in the not right way in a lot of cases. Even though there's a lot to love about Stone Barrington, like I said. But before I gush on any more about the book, this is where I'm going to end it. And this is where I'm going to say, let me know in the comments down below if you've read any Stone Barrington novels. Let me know if it gets better in your opinion or if it stays the same. Also, if you like the video, please subscribe and ding the notification bell. And you know I make videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday, 12.30 p.m. Central, 10.30 a.m. Pacific, 1.30 p.m. Eastern. So, without further ado, we'll see if it gets better when I review Dirt later on in this channel. But until next time, happy reading. I'll see you again soon. And peace.